Welcome back to a new video. Today we have quite a lot on the agenda. I will be contacting a lot of uh, potential sponsors for the channel and then I will be doing a bit of investigation on a new, new startup idea I recently had. I will hopefully be filming a few other YouTube videos as well as this this day in the life also. I need to do something about my hair but it's alright for now. Uh, let me actually check what we have on the menu. Yes, yeah, so I need to answer to some sponsors, uh, start editing a travel vlog, uh, planning more more my new new startup project or startup product. Then I gotta send send some invitations. Then I gotta do some marketing for my uh, for my Tinkerit.fi company. Uh, then a few things I gotta remember to film today, and then a bit more advertising as well. So yeah a bit of coding but a lot more advertising and uh yeah but interesting work tons of different stuff new stuff as well here so let's get it but i gotta go do something about this hair situation it's it's not all right okay now i look way more presentable but yeah let's get back to work ah uh. So wonderful, I will, I'll have to do with some corporate uh, BS right now because uh, we recently changed our marketing or messaging or like information channels to be exact and now I will have to have, ha ask admin, admin rights for like certain channels on the on the new uh, information communications uh, channel that we have so yeah just a, just a bunch of corporate BS so to, so to speak. But yeah, now hopefully if people answer to me, I'm able to get the admin admin rights. Yeah, it's a pain in the ass, so to speak. Oh yeah, it's lunchtime soon. I'll actually start like <coughs> editing the editing my travel vlog because uh, it's there's quite a lot of content there. But actually, I can't post it for for a few weeks yet, so I'll just have to wait for it. But at least I can start editing it, so I'll, I'll have it ready, which is good. <sighs> but before I do anything, there is something I need to take care of. Ha! Huh. It works. Thank you, Kelly Kelly Wakasa. How do you say his last name? Thank you, Kelly Wakasa. Wakasa. Kelly Wakasa. Now I will have to uh, move just a bunch of stuff from this camera. Or the SD card, actually. Uh, to my to my uh, hard drive. I'll see you in a bit. I'm just mostly doing like a bunch of raw edits right now. Just getting the big picture of the whole video I filmed. I had about 25 gigabytes of data from three days, which is which is I think I think a good amount good amount of uh, like uh, content. I didn't speak that much on camera. So that's why it's not as much as it can be on some some days, because often when I speak in front of the camera, it actually just uh, increases the video length quite a lot, which of course makes sense since I'm uh, sharing content, which takes a bit of bit more time. I don't know why I'm overthinking speaking right now uh but yeah i just have a bunch of b-roll just a bunch of cinematic shots nothing nothing really with uh me speaking in front of the camera because i didn't really have time so uh <clears throat> yeah it's gonna be more of a cinematic behind the scenes type of vlog we just uh, i don't know calm cool and collected music in the background but not allowed to show you right now what i'm anything but i, I hope at some point i will show you so don't worry you'll you'll definitely this video will be online by the time i upload this video maybe two weeks one week uh, from from that I also have to edit this video like this week I think on Saturday Saturday or Sunday most likely I'll edit this and then upload it early next week <coughs> so yeah this this week might be one of the first weeks where I don't have a proper video because I filmed I filmed one video last week like uh, me talking in front of the camera but I really wasn't happy with the quality of the video so I just decided that 
not gonna be posting that video so i'll just i'll just completely scratch the video idea itself is is pretty good but just how i how i filmed it i didn't really like like that very much but yeah now back to back to this and i'll explain more about my startup idea later today uh what do you like uh of the color grading in this video i'm finally moved back to uh d log d log coloring so i can actually have more variety in the edit when editing it so tell me please let me know what you feel feel about the uh, color correction or the color color grading color editing color in general in this video and i will be happy to read your comments down below A massive shout out to Zeko Cloud for sponsoring this segment of the video. If you are building an application that needs real life communication or messaging or video calls, this is the application for you. So you open Zeko Cloud at zekocloud.com and in here they make it insanely easy to add video calls, voice calls, live streaming or even chat to your applications. And instead of using your own time and money, spending weeks building it, you can implement it in just minutes. Ship faster without actually sacrificing quality. And if you want to try Zeko Cloud, it's super easy. Just go to zekocloud.com, add your company, add, add your name, email, what you're doing, all the basic information. Uh, once you have made your profile, you'll get access to their development console. And the best part is that you actually get 10,000 free minutes. That's, that's a lot of minutes. So you can fully like, properly test it out and even actually have it, have it already in use. Because 10,000 minutes is, is quite a lot. It takes, takes quite a lot of time to actually use all those 10,000 minutes. So you're gonna, you can properly test this out, which is, which is perfect. It, it's very easy for you to just give it a go. I think 10,000 minutes is way more than what you would need to build a prototype or even make the first launch of your application. Plus, the documents are, are very clean. There's examples for everything here. You can integrate them with minimal code, so you can actually focus on what makes your app unique, which is the key, and Zego Cloud is here to help you. So, whether you're working on something uh, cool like a multiplayer game, startup idea, or just exploring in general, check out the first link in my description or go to zegocloud.com. Thank you so much for Zego Cloud for sponsoring the video. Now, let's get back to work. So, I got some comments on my last last week's video about uh, not entirely showing or telling how my application works. And yeah, that's my bad. That is on me on uh, bad communication, I guess. One, co one comment was about, well, I'll have the comment on the screen now, but also about like, yeah, about not fully telling what the app does. So, World of the Maps uh, is a data, daily data game. It's a 3D globe where you are trying to guess what data is the map or the globe presenting to you. So what data is it trying to show you? Is it, is it about some economical data? I always have the options on the side. So yeah, the main question is what data is the map trying to show you? Is it a uh, literature rate? Is it uh, average life expectancy? Or what, it, what is it? Yeah. That's basically the key here, that it is trying to show you what, it is trying to present you a data set and your job is to guess the data set. There is a few hints there, uh, like you can see the min and the max rates, <clears throat> and then there is the color range, which of course tells what has low value and what has high, high value. Another one, another big thing is that if a user guesses correctly or incorrectly, there should be some kind of a pop-up telling them that they uh, guessed like correctly or incorrectly. So I added that one there. I have a, a title there sh saying that what data is the map presenting. Right now it leaves the screen after 15 seconds. I'm debating if it should be there for more. Uh, I'm not sure about that, but uh, of course. Some, so for some reason there were some issues with loading the data. It took, took quite a bit. Uh, I did look into that. I tried to optimize it better so it has better, better performance and it loads the data faster. 
Uh, also, a um, comment about there should be maybe some indication that for some reason it's loading a bit slower now, so please hold on. So, yeah, that's actually a good shout. I, I think I should add, add something like that here, but that's very good. But uh, thank you so much for your comments. But I had to put on something warm, I guess. It is starting to get quite cold uh, here in Finland, so yeah, I gotta, I gotta dress up. For some odd reason, it just took a lot. Uh, yeah. But this took me quite a lot. And okay, okay, now it's. Oh. Uh, nice. We're trying to build these applications. Damn, I just uh, had a, about a two hour stream, live stream of me just just developing a new application, like a new YouTube, YouTube SEO search engine optimization tool, nothing major. Uh, I can have the, I have the land, I'll have the landing page here uh, as a screenshot, but yeah, just did a two hour stream and actually my best, like easily my best stream ever. I had like, I had 93 people, 93 views, I had so many comments, I had over, over 50 comments of just talking with people, <coughs> which was so nice. People were super nice and yeah. Yeah, I don't know if, if anybody sees the, sees the video, but thank you for being in the stream and I, my stream, st stream, st stream times are so random, there is no consistency, so I appreciate so many people coming up and joining and actually participating in the chat. It's it's so amazing, it's so nice. I, I appreciate you people a lot, so yeah, a massive, massive shout out to you people. Thank you for watching this stream. Uh, right now I've been on the computer for like two to three hours. Uh, I'm gonna take a short break, I'll go on the couch couch for a little bit, I'll watch watch I actually might watch YouTube. Very YouTube obsessed guy, this guy. But uh, <coughs> I'll watch a bit of YouTube, then uh, just just a bit of relaxing, and then I'll get back to back to coding. I might might film another uh, video video today or something or something along those along those lines. Again, thank you so many. Thank you for the people in the stream. I appreciate you much. And now. Time to relax for a little bit. A bunch of stuff still to do in the code. Uh, basically, the whole idea of the application is to build, uh, like, optimize your YouTube videos automatically. Like, do a search engine optimization of your YouTube videos automatically. Just link your YouTube channel and just uh, let let my uh, application do the magic. There is a few similar tools, but none of them are what I want. They are either too expensive, not automated, or or something along those lines. Building a cheaper and an automated tool to get the best best results out of your videos. Because every every time I get so many uh, comments and so many emails about people asking. Uh, Kaksi viikkoa sitten. Niin. 